In May this year, a clash between angry Nkranza youth and the police led to the death of a 19-year-old senior high school pupil of the Nkranza Technical Institute. Since then, the municipality has been without an active police post as the police shut down all police stations and transferred all personnel within the division for their safety. More than two months after this decision, crime rate is on the rise within the area, a situation the municipal chief executive and chairman of the municipal security council, Daniel Oredu, described as worrying. Those that were left behind, I think as we speak, we are about um, 124 of the policemen manning the place and they have a specific mandate. The other issues are not part of their mandate. Uh, issues that have to do with uh, crime, reporting, murder and other things. When you visit them, they will tell you to go to Techiman. And so, as we speak, crime situation is on the ascendancy. Something very worrying. Murder, ro robbery, theft, almost all forms of crime are on the rise. And, and, and we need to look at it. The MC noted that there's been a minimum of five murder cases since the closure of the police posts and the assembly's coffers are being drained as a result of handling crime issues in the municipality. When somebody's attacked, robbed, or maybe murdered, we have had about four or five murder cases since the incident. And all these incidents, you will have what we call the citizen arrest before the police comes in. And even with that, they will ask you to go to Techiman and report over there because the police presence here are not responsible for normal policing. Like I told you initially, they are here for uh, mining of government institutions and other vital organizations we have. And so it's, it's, it's causing us a lot. It's causing us a lot. Imagine how much the assembly is spending um, in the upkeep of all these. Sometimes when certain cases happen, you will have to rent uh, for people to carry those corporates to Techiman and other issues. It's, it's really causing the assembly a lot. Daniel Oredu, who disclosed that he has already had the opportunity to meet the IGP and the National Security Minister on the same subject, sent a passionate appeal to those at the helm of security in the country to come to the aid of the people by reopening all police stations under the Nkranza division. I have had the opportunity to meet with IGP, National Security Minister, speak about all these issues to them. I would seize this opportunity to further appeal to the authorities concerned, specifically IGP, Interior Minister, and then the National Security Minister, to kindly get the policing system in place back in Nkranza. Because if that is not done immediately, I'm afraid something untold can happen, looking at the situation that we find ourselves in. The MCE's call comes at the back of an earlier appeal by the traditional authorities during a tour of the area by the regional minister. And until a decision is taken to restore policing in the area, the people won't have to live without an active police station. And as Sabit, Joy News, Nkranza.